At the main market in Maiduguri, business is picking up. Traders here say there's been a significant increase in the number of trucks picking up goods to take to Chad, a month after hostilities broke out in Sudan. Business is getting more profitable. We delivered only a small quantity of goods in the past. Now truckloads leave here to Chad and even return for more in less than 24 hours. But Sudanese goods like sesame, groundnuts, hide in skin, that follow the same route no longer get to Nigeria because of the fighting. Adam Mele Mustafa has seen his family income plummet by more than 80% because of the disruption in trade. We buy a lot of goods there, but we didn't bring it to here in Nigeria. It's a hole there. That's left many workers redundant, unable to feed their families. Fighting in Sudan has effectively cut off supplies from Port Sudan through Darfur to Eastern Chad. And with crisis in its neighbors, like Libya and Central African Republic, Chad is turning to Nigeria. But insecurity on their common borders is a problem. This is the old Trans-Sahara trade route, or what's left of it. It's an important link between Nigeria and countries such as Sudan, Central African Republic, and the two Congos. Keeping this route open and free from attacks by armed groups such as Boko Haram and ISIL affiliates is crucial to the economic survival of landlocked Chad, especially now that crisis in its neighbors is impeding the flow of goods. Observers say Sudan crisis offers a unique opportunity to launch a final attack on armed groups destabilizing the Lake Chad region and beyond. This is a greater opportunity to activate the multinational joint task force of the Lake Chad Basin Commission, which Chad is already a contributing and very active partner. He says the regional task force fighting the insurgency in the Lake Chad region must also collaborate with other Central African countries to ensure lasting peace. Something traders at this market say they desperately want to see for business to thrive. Ahmed Idris, Al Jazeera, Maiduguri, Nigeria.